what is it about quitting drinking alcohol that is so difficult you know there's so many people find difficulty in just doing this one thing i mean if you think about it the actual process of quitting drinking is so simple you know it's so easy you just don't put the stuff into your mouth anymore so why is it that so many people have so much difficulty in just doing this one thing well the answer lies not so much in the alcohol itself but in what is left behind after the alcohol is taken out now think about it the alcohol could be anything you know it could be another drug it could be heroin or cocaine cigarettes anything like that um, it could be chocolate it could be tv it's the habitual repetition over and over again and you take the focus of that repetition out of the thing out of the habit that's what you're missing you know there's fear of missing out you know in future that's what stops people and gets people to say to themselves well um you know i can't do this in the future i can't i can't do this forever you know because they're projecting themselves into the future and sort of projecting that fear into the future as well so what you've got to replace is the holes the gaps the the void that's left behind because of the behavior uh, because you've taken that alcohol out by uh, the root so to speak and you've got to replace that with something else you've got to replace that behavior with something else now think about how a habit works it works by repetition you do the same things over and over again and usually there's one thing at the core of that so you do this one thing over and over again in different situations and the longer you do this the more situations you actually do the one habit and so the more places you drink the more people you drink with the more times you drink so on and so forth and it's difficult then to extract that one thing out of the equation without feeling some sort of loss and it's in that loss that you have to focus your attention not on the thing that you're getting rid of the alcohol but in trying to fill the gaps with other better healthier things and it's one of the major reasons why people go back to drinking alcohol time and time again they focus their minds on the wrong thing they focus their minds on the thing that they're trying to get rid of instead of filling those gaps filling the voids getting alternative behaviors and the reason why people go back over and over again is because it's so easy to make the pain go away you know all you have to do is start doing the thing that you used to do if you think about it the more that you drink the more um, your life starts revolving around drink entertainment starts revolving around drink relaxation stress relief all of these areas start to all of a sudden become interconnected with alcohol so you've got so many different areas that you've got to focus your energies on in order to uh, find alternatives and the answer to um, to the, the discomfort of the moment is just to start doing the thing that you stopped you know start taking the drug again and all the pain will go away but it doesn't it's an illusion you know the pain only goes away momentarily so um, if you want some help in quitting drinking alcohol i've got something over on the website alcoholmastery.com that i think you're going to love it's my new book 10 steps to stop drinking alcohol for good now if you download this book if you read it and apply the principles i'm sure that you're going to get so many different benefits it's a real help for those who want to quit so just click on the link down below go to the website and leave your uh, best email address and i'll send you out a copy straight away all right take care of yourself onwards and upwards bye now